stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please pause for 30 seconds of silence. Good morning, Grizzlies. This is James. I'm Talia. And I'm Esmeralda with GN and your Grizzly News Network. Today is Friday, September 24th, 2021. We are just three weeks away from our homecoming game and dance. Get your tickets to the Nightmare Before Hoko during both lunches at the Banker. Tickets are $20. Once you pay the Banker, bring your receipt to the Stuco representative by the Grizzly Bear in the quad to pick up your actual ticket. In these uncertain times, don't miss out on these opportunities. Buy your tickets early. The event is only open to Spring Valley Grizzlies, so no guest passes are being issued this year. Before the dance, we have the homecoming game, and that means you need to come up with something amazing to show off for your organization or club. This year's theme to the homecoming is a nightmare, nightmare Before Hoko, a Tim Burton theme. You can do something with that theme or based on your department, organization, or club. You can use wagons or shopping carts, and the floats will be a part of the parade during halftime of the game on October 8th. We can't wait to see what you come up with. All this month, we will continue bringing you information on the Hispanic culture as part of Hispanic Heritage Month. Frida Kahlo was a well-known Latin American artist who challenged global perceptions of the arts as well as the role of women in artistic and political movements. If you would like to learn more about the culture and join your school in celebrating Hispanic heritage, join Seoul each Friday after school at 1.20 in room 311. Now here's Talia with summer news around campus. Thank you. During this Hispanic Heritage Month, our Spring Valley Symposium was to take on the important issue of immigrant and refugee students. In collaboration with Seoul, the symposium will be hosting this discussion next Wednesday, September 29th at 1.30 in room 310. Everyone, everyone is welcome to attend and talk about the big issues affecting immigrant and refugee students. Grape juice will be provided. Dancers have been working hard on perfecting their choreographed moves, and now is your chance to check out their skills. Come to the Spring Valley Performing Arts Department Gala next Thursday, September 30th at 6.30 p.m. in the theater. It is free to attend, so please come and support. Performing Arts hopes to see you there. Cricket Club is meeting on Monday, and we're still looking for new students to come out. We will meet on the outside basketball courts at 2 p.m. Make sure to wear comfortable shoes and clothes. We love teaching new players about the game. Seniors, the long-awaited moment is here. Soon, senior shirts are available to order. They are $12. Please pay the banker and bring your receipt to room 503 or the Stu Co. representative in the quad to give them your shirt size. Juniors. Juniors and seniors, there are still quite a few colleges visiting this week. Today, the Wolfpack will be on campus. Univer University of Nevada, Reno will be informing students on their school at 9 a.m. You need to register through the link in your email or go to tinyurl.com backslash visit. Now here's James with our sports news. Thank you. Some important changes to this week's sports times. Women's soccer will actually stay home today for games at 4.30 and 6. This week our football team is headed to Mojave. Today varsity is at 6 p.m. then JV takes the field tomorrow at 9 a.m. Tennis takes the courts tomorrow playing against Chaparral at 9 a.m. here at home. Just as a reminder, a school ID is required to all enter all paid school paid events like our football games. Without an ID you will not be allowed to enter. Book bags are not allowed at any paid athletic events. And one final reminder, you must buy, all ti all, buy tickets to all football games at Ticketspigot.com. Now here's Esmeralda with today's weather. Thank you. It looks like we will continue having cool mornings as we start off today in the 70s. We will, we will reach a low of 68 and a high of 95 this afternoon, cooling off to the 80s. Next week, we should expect days to get cooler with possibility of clouds ahead. This was Talia, Esmeralda, and James of, of the, the Grizzly, Grizzly News Network. Network. Have, Have a fantastic, fantastic Friday, Friday Grizzlies. Grizzlies.